What up YouTube, it's, I'm finally back with the long-awaited, long-requested creation of my NBA 2K12 My Player, and it's my, it's gonna be kind of a grind for me to get games out for you because every single game I'm core <laughs> right there, there's a cute little message for y'all, but every single game that I record takes up about like 20 to 30 gigs of memory, at least the ro rookie showcased it so why did I type in oh yeah never mind but <laughs> I thought I typed in Cam Newton for a second my bad but anyways YouTube um I'm back making Brandon James again you know for the third year in a row unless if you guys if you guys watched my 2k10 commentaries then it's been a long way coming long time coming hopefully I can get a, a lot of new moves a lot of interesting things happening with this player a lot um, the great ways to entertain you guys and such but besides that oh look this year can I finally put my birth oh yeah I can finally put my official birthday in there <laughs> that's always cool that's always something I wanted in games like come on like let me just have fun like <laughs> like when 2k uh, like back in the day I would always want to put uh, like when and be like alright whatever it, just, it doesn't make a difference but anyways I'm back and um these play types. I'm wondering, what do, are these play types going to do anything for me when I'm actually playing the game? Like, do they change the plays that are called for me? But eh, it doesn't matter. Let's see. They change the creation a lot. And in my previous my player, let's see if I can beat beat it. But my previous my player, I was drafted by the Detroit Pistons. I had a really strong rookie showcase, and I want to see if I can repeat that here. Maybe even better. Get drafted number one. But um, it should be it should be fun. To see how everything goes. My draft strategy is more like get drafted as high as you can. It could be by like a team with a point guard already, like the Bobcats, or it doesn't matter because the higher you get drafted, the more money you start out with, which should help your my player get better. Which at the end, oh, he looked weird as that. <laughs> Yeah, that mustache, but which should make your map player better, which should, you know, make him a beast and have the crazy highlights you guys crave to see. M a mistake I made with my previous one is I played too much play next key game, so before I knew it, halfway through the season, I'm stuck on the bench with a bunch of new players I haven't seen, like, we had Anderson Verigel, Manu Ginobili, like, it was just weird. But, so that's, I'm hoping not to make the same mistake. And I got the exact same looking BJ3, B train, James, James to the lane, James not playing games. All right, I'll come up with new catchphrases. Oh, and I'm rhyming accidentally. But they have a lot of new cool equipment in this game. And I know I'm late. You guys are thinking this should have came out a month ago. But in my defense, 2k didn't send me the game uh, until like a month after because shipping took a mad long time so for people that want to see my Hashim the beat games I'm still trying to get some out like I just started averaging six points per game so you gotta excuse me <laughs> um, I might want to change it to like a guard you know that's like my main type of play play style until I get accustomed to the game enough, and then I'll make um, and then I'll try to make Kashim to be the beast that he was supposed to be, and um, and we'll see from there. But I, but for now, let's just focus on BJ over here. Oh wow! All right, um, don't take the last statement in the wrong co uh, context. But right here we get we got some nice calf sleeves and. Something that we've been wanting in 2K for a while. I made him much different. If you want, I can show you guys my Pistons, Brandon James. It looks much... He looks way more different. He doesn't even look like the 2K11 one. Because I just created him and went. I'm like, let's just do it. I don't want to really work on this. But whatever. Let's see. Oh, those kicks ain't going to fly. They ain't going to fly. Let's see. Let's see what shoes you got us this year, 2K. You, they don't have the Jordan increased attribute shoes. It sucks, but it's whatever. 
There you go. You got the Nike Zoom Kobe's. I got to pay homage to my boy Kobe Bryant. Nike Zoom Kobe Ford. Broken ankles. <laughs> Who ever seen that commercial? It's a mad funny commercial. If you guys, if you guys should go check it out. But over here, um, you guys can see I start out with 88 speed, 60 like something pass. Definitely need to work on that. Everything here is poor. I definitely need to work on that. So over here, it takes me a while to create my shot because I'm like, hmm, doesn't look right. Still doesn't look right. Hmm, does that look right? Nope, nope, uh, uh, eh, not really. But, um, <sighs> I like this feature this year. Could you have a, could you actually have, um, NBA players releases though? Or do you have to create their jump shots from scratch? Yeah, if anyone knows, like, let's say if I want a Kobe Bryant's jumper or LeBron James jumper, not that I do want it, but would I have to um, go find out how, like, what release and jump shot he has or what uh, what form he has or something? But all right, I'll just figure that out later. But um, besides that, I guess. Uh, Wow, I did take a while to make this. But besides that, the Cowboys just lost. I found that out. I wasn't real happy. <laughs> I was like, come on, you know, like, I'm more bummed out that I can't watch the games. Coop Saints lost. I died of laughter to the Rams. <laughs> you got waxed. If anyone, if anyone wants to, uh, everyone should just go and tell Coop that Drew Brees sucks. And his team is a failure, and they lost to an 0 and 17, 0 and 18 actually, eh, seven or eight, I don't know. But either way, the Rams got their first win against the New Orleans Saints, and I know how happy Coop is about that. So just make sure to remind him as much as you can, so just so you could help him further enjoy the moment of his team's greatness. So, anyways, YouTube, this video is about to come to an end. If you like, if you want to see my next video, please thumbs us up just to know I'm doing something right. It's your boy Mim signing out and peace.